Hello and welcome to Brina Creations. In today's video, I'm going to share with you how to preserve beans to last for long. You need a bowl that has a tight lid. You need your beans. The cleaner, the better, or the fresher, the better. That way you don't have a lot of pre-existing weevils in it before you now do what this process. So you need also pepper, very hot pepper. An alternative to pepper would be bay leaves or cloves but i prefer pepper because i mean if i find pepper in my beans it won't matter but if the bay leaves or cloves seep into it by accident um you know those are very strong um spices and they can alter alter the taste of your beans even though they are good for your body but if you don't mind i mean feel free and then the pepper too is cheaper you know guys compared to bay leaves and and then the cloves so this is what i do whenever i buy my beans regardless of the type of beans an alternative would be to put them in a, a gallon that has a tight lid and just pour even without the pepper you you're good to go once air or oxygen doesn't get in it has tendency to last for as long as possible you want to use smaller cans so that you don't have to open if you want to pour from it but yeah this is what i use and it works for me i try not to buy it too much at a time because um i don't really have that gallon thing going maybe in the future i will but this is what i do for now i've just poured in the pepper and i'm going to just mix with my hands the alternative would be to layer it layer by layer you put in maybe a bowl and then you pour some pepper in and then put another bowl and pour some maybe in a different video i will show you how to do that this method you can do for your beans another i'll be showing you your subsequent videos on how to preserve your flowers and then you can also do this for your rice yes guys you can do this for your rice if you have some rice that is not as fresh you know that after over time weevils may start to eat them you can put your pepper or your bay leaves i prefer to use bay leaves in the case of rice though so guys i hope you enjoyed this video i make videos on healthy living budgeting and great recipes and of course how to manage your home on a budget and kitchen tips so for someone like me that consumes about 10 cups of beans per week when i'm measuring i'll measure 11 cups knowing that those uh, peppers will make up um, about one cup there about out of the 11 cups of beans that i have measured meanwhile this is my leftover beans these beans i have um, more my beans that is was in the can before I added these fresh beans now and you can see that we still have some pepper in them I separate the beans but I put them all in this can and this is what I do if I had another bowl I would use the bowl rather than the plastic bag but I mean the plastic bag still works for me and I just put that separate in the same bowl and I make sure to have a a, a, a measuring cup which is what we use in every can or any every bean that i use so guys don't forget to subscribe share like i hope this video helps you guys let me know in the comment section what you think i'll be seeing you guys in another video don't forget to give me a thumbs up like share comment and subscribe bye